Hey everybody, my name is Chris. Welcome to Casual Fragrances. Hope you're having a great day. If you're new to my channel, welcome to the channel. I talk about men's fragrance related content, unisex fragrances, and sometimes female fragrances as well. So if you like fragrance content and you're new to my channel, you enjoy this video by the end, make sure you search support by clicking that red subscribe button down below. Like the video and if you have any fragrance related questions or anything about this video, leave a comment down below as well. Today is a cool video. It's a new fragrance that came out from the house of Dua. If you're not sure what Dua is, Dua fragrances make uh, inspiration fragrances or AKA clone fragrances and they make fragrances just in general that are fragrances from their own brand. Big shout out to my friend Jeff um, for letting me borrow this bottle. This is not my bottle and Dua did not send me this bottle for review or anything. So please keep that in mind. This is the first impression. I heard it's a good fragrance. So it's called Scent Memory Miami. So it's supposed to be a thing of Miami. I'll zoom in and show you the presentation. Beautiful presentation. Even Kelly said it off camera. I let her smell the fragrance. I have not smelled it yet. Nice box with the white inside with the bottle, which I'll zoom in and show you in a moment. Ladies and gentlemen, this fragrance retails for $150. They do have it on sale with Dua right now. 30% off um, for about a couple of days and the sale is over. So keep that in mind. You'll get it for 105. This is a 50 ml bottle, a unisex fragrance. Let's go over note breakdown. I'll pop it on the screen right here for you guys. We have white florals, grapefruit, uh, temple oud, aquatic notes, mint, sugar, sea salty breeze, ambergris, and, and white. So let's so this presentation is really beautiful. This is something I really do like the detail of it as well. Beautiful cap up top. I'll spray it on skin to see how it smells and develops. Okay, a couple sprays. I do like the bottle as well. Nice, beautiful bottle. Okay. Okay, so this fragrance opens up very refreshing. You're definitely picking up this sea salty breeze vibe in a fragrance. You do get hints of mint in this fragrance as well. And that sea saltiness kind of gives you that summer type of feel in the fragrance. Kind of a blue feel as well, but I wouldn't call it like a Blue de Chanel Dior Sauvage, but it's a fresh blueness about this fragrance as well. Uh, definitely a lot of aquatic notes in this fragrance as well. It's a nice aquatic type of summer marine type of fragrance. If you're in a fragrance like you're definitely going to like this as well. And there is some sweetness to this fragrance as well, which is very nicely blended with the fragrance. So it's a freshness slash aquatic slash a, a sweetness in the fragrance. So it does have a nice bit of projection from the opening right now. You can definitely, I can definitely pick it up in the air. I don't have to dig my nose in the fragrance. I see myself wearing in the warmer months. Definitely right now it's in that 90 to 95 degree weather outside. This is a perfect scent for it. Now in this fragrance here, you definitely do get a lot of this sea salty vibe, a little bit of that seaweed feel as well. If you don't like fragrances like that with that type of vibe, you're not gonna like this fragrance here. A lot of aquatic notes in this fragrance as well. So if you're thinking of fragrances like Pac Bon, Invictus Aqua 2018 that has a lot of aquatic notes in it. It might a little bit of bubble gum in it, but it's more mainly an aquatic type of scent. You're gonna like this fragrance. You're not the same, but it has that aquatic vibe in the fragrance. And a lot of fragrances, like remember Aqua de Gio, I think it is Profondo. It does have that sea salt, the aquatic vibe in the fragrance. So if you like fragrances like that, you're gonna like this. It's not the same fragrance, but think of fragrances like that of aquatic vibe. This fragrance is gonna have that uh, similarity to it because some people always want to hey Chris does this fragrance smells like this or what does it smell like without actually smelling it because they don't have decans to buy so you have to blind buy this fragrance which I don't really recommend to people to blind buy fragrances especially over $150 but at the end of the day it's on sale for 105 so if you don't like it you can probably resell it and get some of your money back for the fragrance okay I'm back guys so now I done smell the mid and the dry in the fragrance for about a good hour and a half or so the middle of the fragrance, you definitely do pick up the mint as well as you get in the opening, but the mint, the mint isn't as, I want to say as strong as when it first opens up. 
you definitely do pick up hints of the mint in the mid, and then you pick up a lot of that aquatic, and you do pick up this sugar, this sugar vibe in the fragrance. It gives it that sweetness, which is very nice. It's weird how you have a bit of a freshness and a sweetness in an aquatic fragrance. You don't really see that too typically on the market, unless you want to go with Invictus Aqua 2018, but. That's more of a bubblegum, freshness, teenager vibe. I don't call this a teenager vibe. It's just fresh and sweet, which is nice. The blending very well. Now to dry down, you pick up this amber grease, kind of musky as well, and it's okay. I prefer the, the opening and the heart of the fragrance or slash the middle of the fragrance more than I enjoy the dry down. But you're gonna have that fragrance. You may hate the opening and love the mid and the dry down or vice versa for the mid, the top, or the base. It could go either or. But this is a fragrance you definitely will get a lot of use of in the warmer months that are coming out or already ahead of us. <laughs> Since we're getting towards the end of summer and that July, August slash area of summer or the end of summer, you're gonna love this, you're gonna spread it, you're gonna rock it. Now the price point is expensive for this fragrance here, so please keep that in mind. This is one where somebody's selling maybe a decan or samples, try to sample it first because you may not like the aquatic feeling of fragrance, because that's what it is. You can see the bottle with the blue juice, this aquatic summer type of fragrance slash spring fragrance. This is not gonna be your oud fragrance. This is not gonna be your heavy patchouli fragrance. This is for a refreshing type of fragrance for the hotter months. If you don't like fragrances that are aquatic, um, sweet type of fragrances, you're not gonna like this fragrance here. And I don't pick up this oud vibe in the fragrance which they do list oud as a note. I don't really pick it up on my skin. So I do, so take that for what it's worth. At the end of the day, I do like the scent. Kelly likes it as well. She gave it a thumbs up. I have to ask her off camera what she gave it from one out of 10. And if I feel like it's worth a full review or buying it, I'll pick up a bottle myself and do a full review. But first impression, it's nice. I want to give it a seven out of 10 on my skin. I do like it for a seven out of 10, but we don't know if it's going to perform or not. I hope I get maybe five or six hours for a freshie. I know my friend Jeff said he got about that four to five hour mark on the skin. So, you know, if I get five or six hours, I can't complain. I don't really want a four hour fragrance for 150 bucks. That's just my own personal opinion or my pet peeve, but definitely try it out for yourself. Everybody's skin chemistry is different. And I do like the presentation as well. So definitely check out one of Dua's new fragrances from the line It's called a scent memory Miami. If you try this fragrance, ladies and gentlemen, let me know in the comment section below. Do you like it, love it or hate it? What's your favorite? Uh, sea salty slash aquatic fragrance designer niche, leave a comment down below. If you like this type of content, don't forget to show your support by clicking that red subscribe button down below so you don't miss any future fragrance uploads on my channel. Like the video and click the bell icon so you'll be notified when I upload new fragrance videos. You'll be the first one to watch it and giveaway announcements as well. Be safe everyone. Me and Kelly care about all you guys around the world and we'll catch you in my next video. Peace.